Welcome to Science with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover different types of consumers, so herbivores, carnivores, and omnivores. Consumers have names based on their diet, so we're going to go through and talk about what that means. So let's start with herbivores. An herbivore is an organism that feeds on plants. Herbivores can be tiny, like an insect, or large, like an elephant. And speaking of elephant, that's one of our examples. And the other is a deer. So again, an herbivore consumes plants. And for an example diet, let's take a look at an elephant. An elephant likes to eat grasses, small plants, bark, fruit, etc. So all plant-based. Next, we have carnivores. Carnivores are organisms that eat meat. Just like herbivores, carnivores range in size. Our examples are lions and orcas, or killer whales. So again, carnivores eat meat. And in example diet, let's take a look at lions. They like to eat zebra, antelope, wildebeest, and other animals. So all meat-based. Lastly, we have omnivores. Omnivores consume plants and meat. Again, there's a range in size, so by now we should notice that size does not determine the type of consumer an organism is. Our examples are a grizzly bear and an ostrich. So again, omnivores consume plants and meat. And an example diet, let's take a look at the grizzly bear. As far as plant-based, it likes eating berries, seeds, and grass. As far as meat, it likes eating fish and elk. So again, plants and meat for omnivores. So there you have it. There's herbivores, carnivores, and omnivores. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.